what is up guys I hi Krishnan here and today I am going to show you that how you can manually update the latest EUI update of the TV Lee 1S uh, which is also which is the EUI 5.5.012 as you can see that is it is that, uh, it is it so here is a small step small step big change and so here I will show that how you can update it so you can see that how to update it manually and I will show you how to update it manually so you have to just click that link and you will be in this page and here we have to just click here to read more of the, about this update and you can just see here we have the release date and all here is the zip file and here is a step by step tutorial you just have to click this link and download uh, the file which is 1.1 GB and name it as update then you have to follow this step open your uh, uh, recovery then click on local update and then just directly press and you can see that there are a lot of lot of change logs which are in India ecosystem they have added their own apps which is Lee VD, Lee View application, Lee Show service and all and the camera has like also had got a lot of bugs a lot of bug fixes and that's very nice to see because and uh, the camera was also very good in this device but it was blurry at times first but now it will be more uh, it will be great and then settings fingerprint you can see that there are lots and lots of change log which has been happened so Leeco has really worked hard to push themselves to bring a great update and so it will surely improve a lot our user interface in our devices so you can also read this link which is of gizmo times you can just come here for more easy if you want to read it you can just uh, directly go to gizmo times and you can see that here and you can also click here download and then directly you can just update it like this so you can do like that so uh, now I will just copy the files and then we can directly show I will show you the procedure how to update it so here as you can see that here is the file which has been downloaded which is the of 1.1 GB and now we are going to copy it into our device so now here we will just copy it here we have to copy it in the root of the device you can see that it is leave one spoon storage so now it will get copied to our main device and after copying I will show you the how you can update it. Win saved as updates or zip. So now we'll update it and you can see that now we have to directly go here and in this will system tools you have to click on system update and this asking a pre-check for your network so let's leave this you have to just click here and then we have to click the local update and now it will search for an update and it's showing that update package found your phone will discharge you are you sure to continue so we'll just press continue after it so guys as now you can see that uh, it's been updating so let it let the update finish and then i will come and we'll see the new features of the ui already we have seen the change log and i'll experience it and tell you my experience of the smoothness of the device now the update has been done and the phone is rebooting into the device so let it reboot We'll wait for a few minutes. So as now device isn't booted and it's been updated to the newest level. And if you can see if you can see that if you can slide to this side, you can see that we get the Lee View app and then the UI overall looks UI smooth and then we have few new apps which includes the we get the we get compass and then we did the Lee VD app which was told there and rest of the apps are the same so now let us go to settings and see the changes in that so you can see that it's the UI is smooth now so let's go to about the phone and now you can see that it's written as UI 5.0.2 is stable so now it's a stable version so that's fine and the android version remains at 5.0.2 lollipop and nothing changes in that so mine is uh, x507 so it will both work for x507 and x500 devices zero storage nothing is the same and then let's see how much ram is left in general so it's telling that swipe down to clear so we know swipe down so around 1.6 gb is left so that's nice and overall this looks just totally good the ui is smooth and after the update I am using the device for like around 2 hours now and I haven't seen any major lag or hiccups and even the device is very smooth uh, the apps open pretty quick you can see that normal apps and everything just open pretty quick and everything is just fine so overall the device is quite nice the apps open quick then fast like previous time 
so now the device feels smoother in hand and guys so this was this was how to install manual install your update and the camera has also improved in i guess because you can see that now how i quickly clicks the photo before it took a small amount of lag now the camera the images which came come are just awesome so now even you can see that it has also improved a lot the selfie camera has also improved let us try to take a pic and i will show you so let me take a pic of it let me just turn off the flash and take a simple pic so here we have taken a simple pic of the device and you can see that the, the photo came out to pretty good so camera all improvements will also be done so overall the device feels nice it's smooth and overall it's very nice so guys i think you like my video if you like my video please give it a thumbs up so guys make sure you subscribe to our youtube channel that is tech geeks you can do that from clicking down button below you can click the red button below to get subscribed to our channel you also make sure to hit us up on facebook twitter instagram and snapchat for more tech news and review stuff that you might be interested in and also make sure to check out our blog which is www.yerobel.in for more tech news stuff and i also blog something about like blogging and how to make money online if you're interested in that you can also check out our blog for more info and make sure you subscribe us on all the social networks or whatever social networks you have to get the latest news and share this video with your friends and fam uh, family and friends so that they might be benefited with the video and i have lots of cool videos in my channel so please make sure to check out all of the videos you might be interested in and if you're interested in purchasing this product please use our link this is the referral link so this link gives us 2 to 3% of commission out of the product for example if you purchase a product for 1000 rupees we get a commission of 2 to 3% which is 20 to 30 rupees of this product and the product value remains same for you which is 1000 rupees itself but if you buy from my link from my reference i got a very small commission of 2 to 3% this helps in uh, upgrading the channel uh, like upgrading audio upgrades video upgrades doing pc upgrades and buying new products for you guys to review so once again thanks a lot for watching guys this is hyrison signing off and i'll get you guys soon my next one yeah.